This is a Steam Greenlight trailer for World of Warcraft. Nope, I'm not taking the piss. I'm not shitting you at all. This is a Steam Greenlight trailer for World of Warcraft. Specifically, you're looking at a Russian trailer for Wrath of the Lich King, one of the expansions for Blizzard Entertainment's popular MMO, which of course wouldn't need to go through Steam Greenlight. One would assume if Blizzard Entertainment wants something on Steam, Blizzard Entertainment can get something on Steam. Basically, Blizzard wouldn't upload a Russian trailer for Wrath of the Fucking Lich King and put it up on Steam, which, according to the email I received, thank you um, for the people who have informed me of this little entry, uh, has been up on Greenlight for about 12 hours, and no one stepped in to, to maybe take it down because it's clearly not kosher, it's clearly not on, but of course, why would Steam step in and stop something? <laughs> Let's not be fucking stupid here. Let's just sit back and enjoy our Russian trailer for Wrath of the Fucking Lich King. If you think this is incredible, I'm gonna start reading the description in a minute. I... I... I, I don't know what's... Like, I, I'm, I want to say who thought this was a good idea. Like, who'd think, oh, I know, I'll put this up on Steam Greenlight, that'll be a good use of $100, and it won't, it, it, it'll get through no problem. No one'll call this into question, but the general quality of Steam Greenlight, not to mention the, the fucking 400 odd games that were greenlit just this weekend, would suggest that it doesn't matter. I'm sure any fucking moron could look at what goes through Steam Greenlight and think that their idea, no matter how banal, no matter how illegal, no matter how stupid, is fine. It's fine. Why not? Why not just put up a trailer for someone else's game? Because you're trying to put WoW servers on Steam. Because that would be okay. Because Blizzard wouldn't have a problem with that. Because Valve wouldn't have a problem with that. Don't be silly. Of course it's fine. Fucking hell. Anyway, the trailer continues. I'm just gonna stop it here. There's some more seconds left to it, but what's the point? You get the picture by fucking now. Description. Server version 0.01.1616. Races. Drainy. Not available. Blood Elf. Not available. Orc. Available. Gnome, not available. Tauren, not available. Troll, not available. Human, available. Night Elf, not available. Undead, not available. Classes, Death Knights are working. It's, it's patch notes. It's fucking version notes. You just scroll down it. It talks about battlegrounds, arenas, instances. All the good stuff. All the good stuff. Some miscellaneous things. Let's see what's in the miscellaneous here. Dungeon Finder is available. The Death Knight starting area is working. The auction house is working. Most vehicles are working. Most quests are working. And then just we go through all of that. And then it's just a whole long list of server versions. Just a whole long list of server versions. And that, friends, is a description for a Steam Greenlight game. Uh, a place normally for uh, independent games by developers um, but this is just World of Warcraft server 3.35 by Post for Coast which is okay now I mean it's not this there's no way this will get through and of course it will get knocked down eventually once someone from Valve wakes up and sees it and thinks oh dear that's trouble but just the fact that someone thought that this was okay I think speaks volumes not just about how naive that person is, but just just what a an open slurry gate Steam Greenlight is, where people look at it and think, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. This is all right to do. You know. <laughs> the Steam Greenlight trailer for WoW. WoW is the word.